I just got out of the shower. Tommy helped me like wash my hair and stuff. And um, I put on a, um, a tank top and for the first time ever, like my like my stomach looks so different um, with a tank top and I just got super emotional um, because I never ugh, I never knew like what it was to like actually have like 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 just like a flat stomach you know and like down here it is completely like flat and stuff like I don't have that big stuff that I you know, would talk about in my videos and it's just like a huge weight like lifted off my shoulder because I don't like it's just oh my gosh like I didn't it's like the little things like this that I can like you know like it's it's like and 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 like right now like my stomach is like still swollen and so like it's just I don't know I don't even know what to say but like I just I'm just feeling like very happy because now like I can actually wear jeans and I'm gonna feel confident and like happy in them and stuff, like without like all this stuff. And I don't know, I'm just, I'm just really happy. Like it's like flat, like, oh my gosh. Like there's no like, you know, like that roll right here and then like rolls over here and stuff. And it's just exciting. Um, but I felt like I had to document that. Um, but here is my, belly button so this so now let's say today is the 22nd of may so nine days uh post um post-op so so post-surgery um and i'm feeling really good um so yeah oh my gosh i cannot believe that this is my new body like and it's still recovering like i'm like i'm, I'm like nine days out from it but like i'm like it's still recovering like when i touch my stomach um, it's like, it's really hard and it's like kind of like numb. Um, I'm guessing from all like the medication and stuff, but everything's like really numb and like my butt is like numb too. So right here, like I had Tommy like touching right here and it's like super hard and swollen. So it's still like it's still healing and everything, but it's just when I, when I, when I put this tank top on, this is like my first time like putting on. So like, you know, like a, this is my first time putting on something on that, or putting something on that's fitted. So like I always had the drains like hooked up on that garment and stuff, but um, I threw it in the wash right now. So, but it's just like, oh my gosh, like this is just like a fitted shirt. And this is like with the swelling, I don't know. I'm just, I just wanted to document this um, because it's crazy. Like, like it is, it is crazy. Like, okay. <laughs> It's just exciting like this part right here like this part right here it's like I mean it's like a little bit swollen like right here but um it's it, there there's nothing I could I would even be able to grab onto nothing and so I'm so grateful for that like I feel so so freaking good anyway I just wanted to um talk about that because it's like always been like one of like my biggest like insecurities let me put my light here um it's always been like one of like my biggest insecurities and so so just like to be able to have like a flat stomach like i don't know it's just I, it, it is it is all the pain that like i went through is totally worth it it is totally worth it so today's monday it's our last day here um and so i'm just getting ready like i'm actually like, doing my makeup today because, um, so we're gonna, I have one more appointment with the Phoenix today, it's at 12.30. We just loaded up the car and stuff, so now I'm just getting ready. My hair is like super frizzy, like I can't wait to get back home so I can actually use like my, all my, all the stuff I have at home for my hair. Um, but anyway, so I'm about to drain the drains. And um, as you can tell, or as you can see, I feel like, I feel like I'm myself again. I'm like normal. Um, I'm not like all like super like loopy and stuff. I'm back to myself, so that makes me happy. Um, so yeah, so I'm just gonna do the little drains and I'm gonna show you guys what the drains look like. Like it's kind of gross. So it's just like, it's not like gross. It's just a bunch of like liquid. So this is what the drains look like. Um, so this one is marked as number two. So there was four total. So they already took out number one, so Hopefully, like I'm thinking that they're gonna be taking out this one as well. The one and two are both hooked like in front, like right here. So there's one, it's like down here, 
of the lady area. So there's one and two, and then the other drains are on the sides. There's uh, three and four. So one has already been pulled out. So now hopefully they take out um, number two. And so the way that they, so the way that I know that they're gonna be taking it out is if you have like 20 uh, milliliters of fluid. So I measure it right here. So 20 milliliters of fluid um, within like 24 hours, then I think you can uh, take it out. So hopefully I'm sound, hopefully that's right. But <laughs> anyway, so I'm gonna show you guys. So I'm just gonna open it up right here. Ugh, okay. And then, so then, okay, so I'll put this in here. Move this way. And you just squeeze it out. So this one, yay, this one actually has 20 milliliters. Okay, cool, so this one, hopefully they can pull out. I think I'm gonna have to like go home with two um, of these drains left, like still in me, so, um, because they cannot take them out until there's only like a certain amount left. So, um, if there's still too much coming out, then they can't take it out. So, hopefully that makes sense. Yep, 20 milliliters, okay, cool. So then what we have to do is we just write it down on this sheet right here. So see, write it on this sheet and then you, you put down like what time or like the date and time and then how much was in the drain and stuff. So that way you can keep track to see how much is coming out. All right, so now we're on our way to a Phoenix. Um, and so hopefully they're gonna take out that drain. And then hopefully I get to see like the, like the scar like I, I have yet to see like what it looks like. And so hopefully I take those off and put new ones on so that way I can record it and see like, so what you guys can see too, like what it looks like. Daddy, are you ready to go? Nope, not ready. Baby, are you ready to go? I'm ready to go. Okay, so here are the trains, one, two, three. So um, they are gonna be taking out um, this one right here. And then hopefully, she said that she's gonna call Dr. Dry, the nurse, uh, Kimberly. She's gonna ask Dr. Dry if they can take out one of the side ones, so that way I can just go home with one. So fingers crossed. Okay, so they were able to take out one drain, and so I can actually see like the scar now, or what's it called, the incision? Yeah, incision. incision. Mm -hmm. so let me show you guys. So this right here is what it looks like. So, but there is the other, um, what's it called? The tube of the drain? drain. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, yeah. Oh my gosh, it looks crazy when I sit down. Holy moly. I'm really happy for you. Thank you. So now they're just putting on this tape that's yeah. gonna go around my incision. And so I have to put this on. I have to um, replace it like every couple days. So, yeah. So I was able to see my body like in a bikini thing for the first time um, without like all like the wrapping and stuff. And let me show you guys what it looks like. And I just like started crying. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. Holy crap. Oh my goodness. Guys, these people are amazing. They are awesome, guys. Oh my gosh. I can't, I can't believe it. Wow. Oh my gosh. That um, the front skin was five pounds, eight ounces. Back tissue um, was three pounds, five ounces. Mm -hmm. So basically nine pounds of the skin was removed. Uh -huh. um, which, and then we also did the liposuction. Mm -hmm. And looks like we did almost three liters of fat. Oh. So if you, like a Diet Coke bottle is two liters. Yeah. And um, so one and a half of those, or almost three liters of fat. Oh my God, yes. that's a lot. Yes. Cool, okay. And that's, so that that's the lipo part. Right. Okay. And then they also do, like we talked about the skin repair of the muscles. Mm -hmm. um, the, the two horizontal muscles um, can get separated mm -hmm. with childbirth, weight loss, so they tighten those together, mm -hmm. almost like a little in internal corset. Uh huh. Okay. So now your skin and your muscles uh -huh. are tight, 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 and with good Very definition cool. too. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I was like interested because I was like. 
Wait, I didn't ask like what, because I know Dr. Dry posted his and he said it was 14 pounds of tissue or 14 pounds of tissue. Uh -huh. So I was like, oh, I wonder how much of that was skin and then how much of that was like the um, the lipo. So I was just curious. Yeah. All right, cool. All right. So there was muscle repair and um, liposuction lipo. okay. and skin removal. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Oh my you gosh, are a new you guys. Woman. I'm a new woman, guys. <laughs>